Hi, this is Saev Moten with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsummit.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsummit.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Hello everybody, welcome to the technical analysis of the Forex market from the ForexPSM.com. As usual, we will talk about the euro currency, start from the daily time frame. Well, on the daily time frame, our market has accomplished uh, our necessary conditions for um, treating the current move to the upside as the potential uh, deeper retracement on the daily time frame. So we see that market has accelerated right to the weekly pivot resistance 2 and exceeded this weekly period resistance one level that usually holds the potential retracements during the long term via trend. So that has happened during the all previous retracement. Market never has exceeded the weekly period resistance one. But currently market accelerates to the weekly period resistance two and that could be the first sign that probably market is ready for some deeper move to the upside. The second uh, confirmation moment is that daily trend has turned to the bullish side. So those of you who trend uh, who trade um, uh, on the daily time frames and use the context on the daily time frame as the condition for the trading now should uh, take the trades on the long side uh, of the market. Third moment is that market has shown breakout of this long term parallel channel to the upside but this price action and behaves as upper breakout with this broadening bottom pattern. So market has shown some nice bullish patterns um, uh, in that area. Now, yesterday uh, we said that market, although it has the bullish context, it, it has hit significant level of resistance. That is daily confluence resistance 129.80, 129.96. Also, market has accomplished some intraday targets of the ABCD patterns. And on Friday we said that although our context holds bullish market is ready for some pullback and that is not the place not the area where we, we want to enter on the long side of the market so we can see that this has happened now in today's video research we will try to estimate how deep this retracement will be and which level what levels to watch for is the potential areas to enter on the long side of the market on the four hour time frame you see that trend turns bearish that suggests that market is ready for some deeper move to the downside also keep in mind that market has accomplished our uh, patron that we have discussed on Friday. This is Judd Napoli potential bread and butter buy patron. So market has hit our support level that we have discussed in the video research 128.92. That was also the previous highs. And retraced to the 618 resistance of whole move to the downside. So that candle has hit the 618 resistance from that swing to the downside. That is the target of this patron market now has accomplished it. But since trend is bearish, we could suggest that probably market could continue some deeper move to the downside. And this could be as potential A, B, C top, T pattern. The target of this pattern is 128.53. It's right here. Also pay attention that right in that area stands the weekly pivot point for the coming week 128.47. And that is the 4 hour confidence support 128.33, 128.51. That is the 3 8 support from the whole swing to the upside. So that is quite logical that market could show some kind of this ABCD pattern. And this could be in general as the cardless triple 2 buy. So on Monday, that is an area to watch for as the potential buy signals in that level. And uh, with the hope that market will continue to move to the upside. Because uh, daily trend holds bullish. Also you can see that this upper board of this previous parallel channel stands very close to that area. So market very often uh, behaves so that it retests the previous broken levels from the other side. So market could retest this level and accelerate further to the upside. At least that area is the first area to watch for on Monday. as the potential area from which the continuation to the upside uh, could start. If market will break that area and Accelerate further to the downside, then probably we will need some uh, additional signs, some more clarification of the situation to make some any decisions about further behavior. So normal price action suggests that market should find support here and continue move to the upside. 
deep retracement currently is not quite logical since market noted we were bought on the daily time frame. Well, and uh, usually market shows deeper retracement when it stands at the remote level. But currently this level is really strong. That is the weekly pivot point. That is the could be the indicator of the sentiment of the market. And if market will hold above the weekly pivot point, this will be additional uh, additional confirmation that um, probably the market bias is still bullish. Well, on the hourly time frame. What do we see? On the hourly time frame, we see that in general, this situation confirms the 4 hour time frame. Although we can see that trend has shifted to the bullish side and market closed above this red line, that is, that is a May City predictor indicator. We see side by side two stop grabber patterns. So, market has tried to shift trend to bullish side but failed here and here. Commonly, uh, stop grabber suggests to take out of the previous lows. The previous low stands right here, 128.89. But if market will accelerate further below this level, then it's probably uh, could lead to the completion of this ABCD pattern. Since 618 target of that ABCD pattern stands above this low, it's 128.91. And in general, this move to the this level seems logical. Well. Uh, that is our expectation on the on the market for a Monday trading session. S since the four-hour time frame holds bearish and market has created uh, two side-by-side -side, uh, stop grabbers, it suggests that uh, probably market is ready to continue a bit uh, lower a bit further. And the first level to watch for is right here. So when market will reach that area, be sure that. Uh, market will not accelerate further to the downside, uh, and you can drop your time frame and watch for the potential buy signals in that area on the 15 minute chart, for instance, to enter on the long side of the market. Well, at least currently, but uh, it, it, it seems like that. So, um, if market will break that area, then probably it's better to sit on your hands and wait for the, some additional patterns and signs that could point on the further potential development.